All right, hello YouTube. Um, I just did a fuel filter and oil change on my vehicle. That would be my 2002 Chevrolet Silverado. And here's the old fuel filter. I'm going to cut the end off of it and see what it looks like. Like they say, do not try this at home. There is gasoline in here. I'll clamp it a little bit tighter. one end off. And there we go. Okay. As you can see, it's pretty black. It's, it's not really bad or anything. Looks like that's where most of the trash ended up right there. Now that may have been from cutting it, I'm not sure. Yeah, it probably was from cutting it. But that's what it looks like. Now this is only after 9,000 miles. It's not clogged up or anything, but it's certainly not pretty. Uh, there's no sediment inside, just maybe a tiny bit of sediment inside there. That could be filings from where I cut also. Yeah, those are filings. So, but anyway. That's what a fuel filter looks like after 9,000 miles. I normally change mine every 9 or 10,000 miles. My truck has 105,000 miles on it, and I have never had a fuel-related problem yet. So I do recommend a minimum of 10,000 miles uh, changing your fuel filter. I don't care what the dealer says or what the book says. They only change it about every 40. I think that's too long, but I guess you can uh, use your own judgment. That is 9,000 miles on a fuel filter. And everybody have a good day.